On October 23, 1970, Gary Gabelich secured himself one more time in the cockpit of the Blue Flame, a car designed with one purpose in mind, to capture the land speed record. A vehicle that had more in common with a missile than a car, its fuel of liquid natural gas and hydrogen peroxide combined in its rocket engine to produce 22,000 pounds of thrust, enough power to approach the speed of sound. As Gabelich accelerated on the Bonneville Salt Flats of Utah, where others before had attempted such a feat, he was able to exceed, for but a moment, 650 miles per hour. When his parachute finally opened, Gary Gabelich set a record run of over 631 miles per hour.